we do see a wide variety of patients. So obviously, people hear hematology, oncology, I think the first thing that they gravitate towards that they like know is the word oncology. So we do see a wide variety of cancer patients. So leukemias, um, solid tumors such as neuroblastoma, Wilms tumor, brain tumors, really anything and everything kind of run the gamut on that. Um, the other aspect of that is hematology. So those are our sickle cell, patients with sickle cell anemia, our patients with um, hemophilias, which are blood clotting disorders, um, as well as other different things such as thalassemia. So we get to see kind of a lot of really of different interesting things um, and we also have a stem cell transplant unit so that stem cell transplant unit um, which used to be my home before I transferred into this role we we also see a wide variety and we are the only uh, children's hospital in Oklahoma that does do stem cell transplants for our patients so those first oncology patients as well as some different kind of genetic patients we've done Pearson syndrome and Hunter's syndrome and a wide variety of things. So it's been really fun to work here for the past nine and a half, almost 10 years um, and get to see such a wide variety of things. I feel like I get to learn new things every single day, which is amazing. So when I started, um, I came fresh out of nursing school, little baby 21 year old, excited to, to learn um, anything and everything possible, but didn't have a big knowledge set when it came to pediatric hematology or oncology disorders. Uh, you learn a little bit about it in nursing school, but not a whole lot. Um, and so I think that we, one of the big things, you know, first and foremost, we want our nurses to get comfortable initially. Like, let's just learn how to be a nurse. Let's learn how to time manage and do all of those things. But then we send you into chemotherapy class so that you can get certified. That's a two and a half day class that we throw any and all information out at you so that you feel like you've got a good grasp on these really important medicines that we're going to be giving our children. Um, we also teach a stem cell transplant class a little later on in the process too. So just always providing those like building blocks of, hey, we're going to lay this foundation of like, let's come in and learn how to just give meds, do assessments, do all these things, but then now let's give you this chemotherapy knowledge so that you know these different medicines and let's give you this bone marrow knowledge so that you know how to adequately take care of a bone marrow transplant patient, how to do that safely and effectively. Um, and then honestly in the world of medicine just in general, but especially in peds and especially in a place like oncology and hematology, things are, treatments are constantly changing and there's always new stuff. Within the past two years, we started doing CAR-T therapy um, over in the children's side. They've been doing it over in the adult side. So this is kind of a fancy, we re kind of make your T cells and put them back into your body to fight, to fight for you. So it, is really a cool thing. I got to be a part of the very first one that we did here at OU Children's. And I just think it is, when I think back to when I started and the small, little amount of knowledge that I had in this field and where I'm at now, and there's still so much to learn and grow every day. Our education team is amazing at bringing in anytime we've got new meds, new treatments, new any of that. We do a little in-service on it. We bring out little hand, just, I mean, handouts, any of that kind of stuff. We want to make sure that our nurses are comfortable with any medicines that they're giving because we're, those are constantly going to be changing and bringing new stuff in. We get to work with a different group of kids. So we have on oncology patients, sickle cell patients, all kinds of hematology disorders. We even do stem cell transplants here and I've added on CAR T cell as well. Working with such a specific population group with the hematology oncology program here, I've had to go through all kinds of uh, different education and certifications here within the hospital. Uh, I have my chemo certification, my transplant nurse certification. We've also did a lot of education with the physicians uh, when CAR T cell therapy started because that was something we had never done here in the state before. Our patients are a lot of times the best part of my job. I love coming to work and to work with our families and our kids as well. Um, they make my day a lot of the time. There's always bad times, but a lot more good times than bad.